Welcome everyone. Today I am going to talk about interview questions and answers that were used in my CNA interview and questions to ask after the interview. So if you want to know more, then keep watching. So I told her um, that I recently graduated college with my bachelor's degree in psychology. Then I proceeded to tell her about past employment history and how the qualities I gained from the previous jobs related to the CNA position. Certain qualities of a CNA is like being empathetic, compassionate, attention to detail, sense of humor, adaptability, communication skills, multitasking. So I just incorporated some of those qualities into how I've gained those qualities over the past years. I just told her how, you know, dealing with angry customers allowed me to develop good critical thinking skills, being able to think on my feet. So I was a resident assistant, so I just um, discussed with the interviewer that I worked with undergrads, undergraduate students and their personal issues which allowed me to um, gain skills in empathy, being compassionate. I like to incorporate three qualities in my um, Tell Me About Yourself. And then I like to close it out with, I believe that gaining all of these qualities like empathy, critical thinking skills, and um, adaptability will make me a perfect candidate for this CNA position. I just researched a hospital. They had the highest grade in leapfrog safety. They were featured in the news. They were ranked for being the best nurse friendly hospital and just things like that. You just have to research the hospital and the more you know, the more you stand out as a candidate. So I just like to list things about the hospital and to also tie into, you know, what I want to do in the future. So I like to close it out and with something I want to do in the future, but not give too much details. I just basically told her that I sought I sought out employment as elsewhere elsewhere for like a better opportunity and to also see more growth within myself because I wasn't seeing that at my previous job. You could just talk about, you know, where do you see yourself in the future, you know? You can say that you're basically excited about becoming a CNA and I hope to you want to gain so much experience and confidence to further your skills or you can say that you want to further your skills into becoming like a LPN, RN, you know, doctor, um, a PA, just you know anything you want just you know, just answer these questions and be confident. And you also don't want to tell too much, but also make sure that you say that you want to stay within the, the hospital and you see yourself growing. You can just think of a personal experience in your lifetime. And you can also discuss like people you know who are also in the field. When I answered this question, I told her just about how um, I had a nurse that helped me through my labor and delivery, how she was so helpful and nice and really guiding. And then also talked about people who, who I know that are also in the nursing field and how I eventually want to become a nurse and a nurse or um, something else if nursing doesn't work out for me. Most interviewers want candidates to follow like the STAR format and situational questions. The STAR format is a technique to answer, is a straightforward technique to answer situational questions. 
So like the S and star is, you know, obviously the situation. Then you have the T for task, which is your responsibility in that situation. And then you have the action, which is, you know, the action you took, the action you took to address the situation. And then the R is the result, which is the outcome. So if you guys get situational questions, you know, follow this format to the best of your ability and you're more likely to stand out. And then finally, always, always, always ask questions. It makes you stand out more as a candidate. It could more likely increase your chances of getting the job. It makes you look more interested and you want to ask questions that stand out. So it's like different than you know all the other no all the other questions that people normally ask. I have a few questions that I asked in my interview. In my interview, I had them written down and I asked if it was okay if I could um, take out my notepad to ask them. And she thought it was fine. One question I had was, "Tell me more about the day-to-day -day responsibilities of the CNA. What's the most important qualities?" to excel in the position, do you expect any changes in the role, and if so, I think I said if so, why? Since I do lack experience in this position, how would someone like me navigate through the job? Who is your top competitor and why? What do you like most about your position and the company? Hopefully this video helps if you like this video. Give it a thumbs up, also a comment and subscribe. And thanks for watching. See you guys in the next video.